Hey everybody, Bryce Prescott here, host of the Rules of Success podcast, coming at you with another video sidecar. Hey everybody, welcome back. This week's sidecar video, I wanted to dive into something that's really important to me and I think would be important to you. If you followed the podcast or this video series, my email series at all, you know that the book, The Science of Getting Rich by Wallace D. Waddles is one of my favorite books and one of the books that I feel is most transformational of all literature that's available. What I've done is I've taken the original manuscript that was written in 1910 and I've added commentary to every chapter of that book that updates the message for our day and age. What I feel has happened with that updated version has given you, the reader, a toolbox for achieving whatever it is that you'd like specific to finances, to health, to wealth, to connection, to relationships. It's all in that book. Additionally, if you've been following me, you've heard me talk about my companion program to that book called Apply the Science. In the Apply the Science program, we do a deeper dive in the framework of a community of like-minded people diving into the processes that actually can collapse the time that you would need to achieve the results that you could achieve by applying the principles in that book. On this message today, what I wanted to do is I wanted to give you an example of what that series, Apply the Science, would bring to you if you were to participate. Hopefully, if you're watching this video, you've gone and you've been able to pick up at rulesofsuccess.com your free copy of the book that I referenced. The Science of Getting Rich Presented by Rules of Success. This book starts off from day one, chapter one, laying the ground rules for how it is that you're able to marry in your own mind the thoughts that you have and where those thoughts take you and what creative power those thoughts have, as well as the action that you need to take, the inspired action to, to be in motion sufficiently to attract those results to you. It's one of the, the most simple uh, frameworks, most simple equations that are out there when it comes to the law of attraction, but it, a lot of it gets overlooked in the need to be in motion for those things to happen. You think, you act, you get a result. In the first chapter of my book, it's called The Right to Be Rich. Here's a picture of it, hopefully you guys can see that. You can get this book by going to rulesofsuccess.com and subscribing to my list. This is what the author says. The very first paragraph of the book, The Science of Getting Rich, says the following. Whatever may be said in praise of poverty, the fact remains that it is not possible to live a really complete or successful life unless one is rich. No man can rise to his greatest possible height in talent or soul development unless he has plenty of money. For to unfold the soul and to develop talent, he must have things to use. And he cannot have these things unless he has money to buy them with. Fast forward a few paragraphs. And he says, In this book I shall not speak of riches in a figurative way. To be really rich does not mean to be satisfied or contented with a little. No man ought to be satisfied or contented with a little. If he is capable of using and enjoying more. The purpose of nature is the advancement and unfoldment of life, and every man should have all that he can contribute to the power, elegance, beauty, and richness of life. To be content with less is simple. Sinful. On week one of Applied to Science, what we do is we go through the first couple chapters of, of The Science of Getting Rich, and we set the groundwork for what really has to take place in the mind, heart, and soul of those that wish to utilize this formula, this scientific formula for getting rich. The first thing that you've got to believe and understand is that it's your right to be rich. We don't need to worry about the past. What decisions you've made that have led to upheaval, the mistakes that are looming your financial decisions, relationship decisions, things with your body, anything that's caused you harm that you've, that you've been a part of, make no mind of those things right now. In week one of the program, we're going to establish that foundation so that you can start forward facing to your future starting today, knowing a few key truths. Those truths are, number one, it is your birthright to be rich. Think about that for a second, your birthright. 
that phrase is thrown a lot, uh, thrown around in, in biblical scripture and in other areas where it's talking about something to which you inherit by nature of who you are. A prince has birthright to the kingdom of the throne. As humans, as members of the human family, it is our birthright to expand. It is our birthright to achieve more. It's our birthright to be rich. And you want to know why it's our birthright to be rich? Because it's in our human nature as a part of who we are to expand and to make things bigger, better, and more efficient around us. The only possible way we can do that is to get rich. So one of the processes we're going to go through in the first week is we're going to, we're going to analyze in the individual, every student that's a part of this, we're going to analyze our different natural reactions when it comes to our thoughts about money. We're going to establish what is really the way that we think about it. Do we sabotage our own successes because we don't think we're worth it? Do we do things based on conditioning from family or friends that make us scared to actually have a lot of money or to, to be a person of means? We go through all those different things so that we can start the ground running week one, providing you the framework to get rid of all that bad conditioning and to have you step into your birthright. Anyway, that's just a little snippet of what powerful stuff we're going to dig into and how the ultimate effect of what the, this course will do for you will be to attract into your life through your inspired action exactly what you've been waiting for. So go to applytoscience.com, check out the video there, sign up, apply at the, for the, there's a questionnaire there to make sure that this is a really a fit for you. By doing that, you're gonna get an opportunity to have a conversation with me and we're gonna discuss with you the specifics of the program on a deeper level. And personally, how it applies to you. So go to applytoscience.com. If you haven't gotten your copy of the book, go do that. It's at rulesofsuccess.com. Got these nice little e-reader formats. What are you waiting for? Anyway, like I always say, till next time, take it a day at a time.